everyone! Dan here from the Dumb Minecraft, and welcome back to Minecraft Pocket Edition. Where today we are Alex. As you can see, I've had a little bit of a gender change, but that is fine for now. I can actually get my own skin in Minecraft Pocket Edition, but I haven't had the time to do it yet, so I'll make sure that is done for next episode. But um, today, you may notice that we're in a different location, but I want to speak about something else very, very quickly first. Which is the fact that you guys absolutely seemed to love the idea of having daily Minecraft Pocket Edition, which I'm so happy about because I can't really do anything else to do with Minecraft. So, let's get to it. So, we are in a different location. I spent a little bit of time just kind of, you know what, I am, I'm getting a bit annoyed with having to open this door all the time. So, welcome to the family. A... a Oh no, pressure plates don't exist in Pocket Edition. Now it's raining and I've got no roof. Oh no, this could have gone a lot better. This could have gone a lot better. So, um, what am I going to do now? <laughs> How much? Oh man, I didn't even have that much cobblestone. So, the reason that I have moved house is because... Uh, the last location was a little bit boring, to be honest. So, the last location was in a jungle, like a mix between a jungle and a plains biome. But now, we're in full plains biome. But, we've got a little river down here because the boats in Minecraft Pocket Edition are actually better than the ones in PC version. And, I'm not kidding. Hopefully, we'll be able to see them very, very soon. We've got lots of mountains and forests around us. I know that the jungle is still all the way over there somewhere. But, that's fine. We don't need that for now. There's also... Ah! Almost fell down. Almost fell down. There's also this, which is a giant chasm. And there's also um, lots and lots of kind of caves around here, which I'm really, really excited about. Look at these. Look, there's so many. I just need resources. There's a massive, like, oh, look at this. And there's a ravine somewhere as well. I'm not sure where it is. Where's the ravine? The ravine is... Ow, what was that? Did something just... Ow. Ow. Oh! Oh, get away! I was like, what on earth is this? No, no, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Where did you come from, sir? Oh, man, are they spawning in because it's raining? Oh, that sucks so bad. Um, oh, I'm not happy with that. I'm not happy with that at all. Naughty little zombie. Those are the worst as well. Right, I need to go ahead and grab some stone because otherwise I'm going to be in major, major trouble. There is a ravine around. Oh, there it is. Look. Nope, that's not a ravine, is it? That's definitely not a ravine. Um, so I'm just gonna go down here and grab some... Oh, it's kind of like a ravine, but kind of not. Anyway, I need to grab some stones, so that's what I'm gonna, um, come here for. So we need more stone to kill ourselves out. We really need some coal still. I just cannot find any right now for some reason. But I am so glad that you guys really wanted this series. And also, I've taken on some of your tips on board. Um, mainly being the brightness. I didn't realize the brightness was so low. But now I've turned that up to max. So that when it's nighttime and when we're in caves, it's a lot nicer to look at pretty much. Let's just grab how much of this have we got. Nom nom nom. We have got uh, 21. I don't think that's enough still because I need to make... I've got a stone axe because I needed to take down my house a lot easier. I'm not going to really do much hitting that other melon, am I? Not going to be too helpful. I broke. Come on, Alex. Put your strong hands to use. Right, let's get out of here so that we can actually um, go and make this stuff now, shall we? Here we go, over to the house, and my trees are starting to grow, perfect, perfect, perfect. I don't need a roof just yet, I'm gonna kind of, I'm not sure if this is like the final thing that I'm gonna, the final house design that I'm gonna use, but for now, let's make us some tools. So I need some stickies, don't I? So I need um, one stone sword, uh, one stone pickaxe, and I want to move these around, so I want to put the stone sword here, the pickaxe here, the food here, what else do we need? I think that's pretty much it, I'm gonna put some stuff in here as well, I don't need these doors, don't really need this flesh, um, the rest though I'm gonna keep on me just in case I need to bridge anything around, so at least I have a sword on me, because otherwise I'm gonna be in big big trouble aren't I? Big, big trouble. As you saw when I um, almost got eaten alive by a baby zombie. Fantastic. Oh, jeez. Right, let's take out this tree as well. And then we're going to go for a little bit of a cave dive. And why? Because we need resources. We need armor up in here. I don't really want to kill those cows yet until I've got a sustainable source of food. Mind you, I've got 49 melons. But I'm not actually sure how long those are going to last me, to be honest. I really don't know. 
But they should last me quite a while, right? They should do. Anyway, is there any coal on this surface? Now, I think it's harder to find coal because there's so many other types of stone around here. Oh, I see some. I see some. Let's be careful, though. I do not want to die. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I think I've set my spawn to where my bed is now. I think I've had to spend at least one night here. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, let me make some torches literally right now because I cannot see a thing. Um, quickly, 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 make some torches. There we go. Boom. And put them right here. There we go. I'm actually fairly fluent in these controls now, even though I am using them with one hand, which means I'm not that accurate with them. But I'm, I'm doing okay, I think. I'm doing okay. Right, finally, some coal. Jeez. You know how long I've been searching for you, coal? You know how long I've been searching for you? It's been a while. It's been a long, long while. Now, there's a lot of features in Pocket Edition that are very different from the PC version. And I also saw this very morning that they are going to add rabbits into the game, which I am looking forward to because rabbits are super cute and I thought this was going to be a cave. It turns out they don't want it to be a cave at all. They want it to just be a tiny little, well... Tiny little cave, I guess. <laughs> right, was there anything in the ceiling, maybe? I need some iron up in here. There's nothing up here at all. Um, there's some of this. I don't know. Nope, there's nothing around. Fantastic. Good stuff. Well, at least we got some coal so we can smelt some stuff. There are some pumpkins over here, actually. And also keep forgetting that you can sprint as well, which is absolutely amazing. There we go. You know what we can get? Let's grab these. Because it's October, we can get things a lot scarier up in here. We can make jack-o'-lanterns. We can put them outside our house. We can also make the all-important snow golems as well. Because I'm feeling very lonely in this world by myself. And with this cow, obviously. But um, I'm feeling very lonely, so I'm going to need a friend now... Inside Pocket Edition is a really special type of snow golem. Lots of you have told me about him already, but um, I'm going to save that for another episode when we find some snow and are actually able to create him because it is going to be fantastic. It will be one of the greatest things you've ever seen. Now, let me see if I can craft this jack o' lantern. You only need one torch, right? Let's make two of those. There we go. And let's put those outside our house. Let's sprint back to the house because we need some kind of light anyway. Oh! What's this? Is this a ravine? It's uh, it's kind of like a mini ravine. Oh, that's the one we were in, wasn't it? Okay, watch this hole, though. That is the... That's the hole of death right there. The major hole of death. Okay, let's put these jack-o'-lanterns down, shall we? Boom, boom. Very nice indeed. That's what I'm liking. So I'm really missing out on the old... Uh, really missing the, the, the pressure plate right now. Okay, let's craft us some more sticks. Because we need some more torches. So let's just grab... Um, yeah, let's just go for that. And then we've got 16 torches. Let's place them inside the house. I really find the building in Pocket Edition a lot easier than PC. Because you can just, like, tap where you want the blocks to go. It's really, really awesome. I love it. Okay, boom. And um, we should be able to sleep now, I think. Things are going to get a little bit crazy up in here. Um, right, i got a door. I've got no roof. So hopefully I survive. Yes. Yes! Yes! That's what I'm talking about, guys. That is what I'm talking about. Okay, let's put some of this stuff back, shall we? Uh, let's put these lanterns back, because I don't need them. Uh, or pumpkins, even. The rest I think I need. I think we're going to go down the big hole. That is what I'm going to call it. The big hole. So there we go. Um, right, where is it? Where is this big hole, huh? Where is it? I'm chopping up flowers all over the place. I don't mean to do that. <laughs> I don't mean to be chopping up all these flowers. Where's the hole? Here it is. Okay, let's delve down here after we eat a melon of courage. That's what this is going to be called. Oh, I need a shovel, really. Let's go and make a shovel real quick. Uh, let's see if I can just lean in through the window. Uh, that's the reason I've got these, by the way, because... Um, oh, man. I'm going to fill these with glass, but I need a shovel to collect some sand and all that good stuff, too. I can't even grab it. Put that down. There we go. Nice. Cheeky. Cheeky, cheeky. All right, let's make some sticks and then a shovel. Very nicely done. Now, let's get rid of that and put a shovel there. Nice. This is just to craft my way out of the hole just in case. So, oh, jeez, why did I do that? Oh, that could have been so dangerous. Oh, man. That could have been horrific. Absolutely horrific. Anyway. Let's continue, because otherwise we aren't going to get anything done today. Now, I need to do this in a very careful way, because I do not want to die. So, let's just, um, I think double tap this, and then your shift mode. I think this is shift mode right now. Or, like, crouching mode, anyway. Uh, I just want to be very, very careful. 
No, I want to get out of that. There we go. Right, we're going down here. And I'm going to make a staircase all the way down just because I do not feel safe at all. Oh, don't jump like that. Don't jump like that. I thought, th I thought something hit me then. Oh, man, this is making me very, very nervous. But we're going down the giant chasm. Is something pushing me? I thought there'd be like a cow behind me being cheeky and pushing me. But it's just where I'm jumping up. Okay, right. We need to make our own little bridge here. There we go. There we go. And chop this down. Get out of here. How tall is this thing? It looks giant. Absolutely giant. I think it is as well. Oh, my goodness. Right, there's coal down here, though. The things I do for coal, guys. The things I do for it. Um, I'm going to go into shift mode. There we go. And place there. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. And then down here. Oh, I can't even place it. I can't even place it down. There we go. Oh, the nerves. The nerves. Right, I'm going to put a torch here just because it might get dark. Um, I don't really want to fall down there, do I? I need to make it so I can get out of here easily if something bad happens. So I'm going to put... I'm going to put one there and one there. That's perfect. And then we're going to put one down here. No, no, that's not really where I wanted it. But you know what? I can deal with it. Let's put one down there. Chop this down. There we go. Nice. Okay, this is this is going well. This is going well. And there's some coal down here too. So if I just knock this out, and I think I'll meet you guys back when I'm at the bottom of this crazy chasm, okay? Okay? I'll meet you there. Okay, guys, I am going to take the plunge, okay? I'm just going to jump down with my sword ready. But look how much is around here. There's so much stuff. I really don't want to get lost. Is there any way to find, like, your coordinates or anything without a map? I don't think there is, but I need redstone and a... It might just be the map that you can use. It might not even be a map either that you can use. Right. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Come at me. Come at me. Is there anyone around here? Okay. It's blocked off down here. That's good. That's good. That's good. Right. I need an escape route. So let's make it so that we go down here and then here. And we should be able to get out pretty quickly. Hopefully. Anyway. Right. Let's start lighting this place up. There we go. Right, we've got some iron. Good start. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, place the torch. Place the torch. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Uh, there we go. I'm so glad you guys told me about lighting up the, um, putting up the brightness, because otherwise we'd be in pitch dark right now. Okay, let's grab this iron before we forget. There's so much around here. Look how deep this is. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. I think someone told me about this. Because uh, you guys went on the seed and were like, Oh my goodness, there's a massive cave system nearby with loads of iron. And I think I might have just found it. Oh, what was that? No. Oh, it's a, it's a torch. Oh, I thought that was like a creeper exploding. I really did. But luckily we're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Oh, it's going to be my first iron. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. i got my first bit of iron of the Let's Play, guys. Cheer. I don't hear you cheering. That's better. That's better. Cheer for me. Okay. Whew. I feel so nervous. I don't know why. I don't know why. I think it's because I know if I die, I'm going to have to come back and get all my stuff. And I'm going to be very, very upset at the same time. I'm going to have to wipe away my tears and collect all my stuff. All right, here we go. More iron for me, please. There we go. So the, the goal of this is at the end to have enough for a... What was that? What is it? What is that? Do that again. What is that? Uh, is that like an Enderman's? Can you see that? Don't, don't make me look like a liar now. Look, what is that? It's puffing. It's it's puffing. And why is that gravel there? Um, I'm gonna press it. Here we go. Nothing happened. Why is that gravel just like smoking? Oh, that's weird. I've never seen that before in my life. That is so odd. Oh, I'm falling in a hole. Great, great, great start. I need to be careful around here because this is looking a little bit treacherous. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is a good start, though. This is a really good start. I'm glad I found this place and moved my house here because it's looking a lot better. Jump up there. Jump up there. There we go. Place across. Careful across here. Come at me. Okay, there's nothing here. Fantastic. <laughs> I was kind of hoping for that, to be honest. Oh, I also gained lots of coal. I got 28 coal, and I now have 9 iron. Perfect. That's beautiful. This cave is really complex as well. Jeez, I should have made two um, stone pickaxes. But I guess making a pit stop isn't going to be a bad thing. 
because we're going to need to, I think, and drop off all the stuff. And then we can be a little bit more risky. We might even be able to, like, just do a suicide run and take torches with us. And then um, just light up the whole place until we die with nothing else on us whatsoever. But we do have experience now. That is another new thing in Minecraft Pocket Edition that we didn't have before. You do actually have experience, so you can um, enchant things. I'm pretty sure there's anvils too. I'm fairly sure. Correct me if I am wrong, so I could well be. But I'm pretty sure there's anvils now. Come on, go around here. And then you can name things, you can enchant things. It's pretty magical. Ah! Oh, I don't want to fall. I'm going to go down this way. I'm going to go down this way. Okay, I've decided my way. Ugh. What's down here? What's down here? I'm scared because the first bit of combat that I see, I am going to be absolutely terrified. Okay, there's water down here. So this is safe. Let's just press this. There we go. Right, there's water everywhere. I love the way the um, water looks in Minecraft Pocket Edition, by the way. It looks really, really nice. I'm not sure why. It just looks a little bit different. And you can craft melon seeds. Man, I'm just terrible at this game. Okay, give me this. Have I got bones from somewhere? Oh, no, it's that. Okay, that's cool. I like that. Um, I need to make that. I need to make some torches. There we go. One, two, three, four. There we go. Let's just make those. Right. Let's see what's down. Where are we going to choose next? It's a little bit up here. So let's take the easy route first. Oh, I said it was the easy route, but it turns out it's actually not. What is down here? I'm so going to get lost, aren't I? I'm so going to get lost. Let me jump down here. Ah, 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 ah. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm sorry, guys. I, I know I shouldn't be scared. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a regular Minecrafter. I should be able to do this by myself. By myself, all alone, but with you guys coming along for the ride too. Okay, okay, we've got some mushrooms. That's kind of cool. I like that. I like that. Give me these. Give me that. And give me this. Mushrooms. That means we can make some mushroom stew. That's what I'm talking about. I'm just going to run around here and light it up and then go back and... Oh. Ooh, hello. I don't know why. I, I, that must be the gravel. The gravel is just making smoking particles. So odd. So odd. There's water above us as well. I'm a little bit scared about... But I just want to grab all of this coal. And I think I'm going to go back up to the surface and see if I can finish my house. Because my house is pretty dire right now. And it needs a roof. But now I've got some iron. How much do I have? Oh, no, 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 no. No, there's water everywhere. There's water everywhere. I've ruined it. I've ruined it. I've ruined it. Oh, no. Right. Right. Get up here. Get up here. There we go. Okay. Right. How much have I got? I've got 33 coal. Only 10 iron. Or is that 18? 18. Yes. That's not too bad. So, we're actually pretty set up. Um, I've got this water that I can now just float down, which is pretty good. Pretty good. There's some iron down here too, which I'm going to grab. Alright, let's take this. 18 iron is really good. I think you need like 30 something for a full set of armor. But I've got... I do need armor, but I want to kind of make the tools as well. I never know which one to make first. I might let you guys decide instead. I'm going to put the pressure on you instead of me. Okay, got some coal. No, some iron. Any more down there? Any more? Nope. Not at all. Okay, this is actually a really good cave diving session. This is beautiful. Okay, there is... Whoa, there's lots of iron up here. Let me just make a little bridge. Tiny little bridge. And then just mine all this up. Uh, and it's actually night time right now. So I don't really want to head to the surface because I'm scared. And I don't know whether I'm going to be able to combat very well. That's the only reason why I'm a bit worried. Because I'm now... I'm, I've got no armor. And I'm a little bit worried that I'm just going to instantly get killed. Because the nasties in Pocket Edition are very, very nasty indeed. Right, what's under here? What is under here? And we've already been attacked by a baby zombie as well. So that's... I'm not a fan of that whatsoever. Baby zombies are probably my least favorite. They're, they're cute and all, but they're probably my least favorite to come across because they're so crazy. They literally just, like, nibble at your feet for ages. And they just don't leave you alone. It's not a good place to be. Not a good place to be whatsoever. There we go, right. I'm going to get lost. Okay. Let's just keep lighting places up. I just want coal and iron so I can smelt it up and make me some armor. Um, oh! Jackpot, jackpot, oh my goodness. We got so much! Yes, I'm just gonna eat this melon real quick. It's celebration. 
celebration. The only problem is my pickaxe is going to die. It's going to die. Let me just light this up instead. Go on. Can you reach? Can you reach, Alex? Use your long sticky arms. Okay, we've got gold. We've got um, more gold. Okay, this is fantastic, actually. This is great. Let's just grab this for now, though, shall we? Until this breaks. Until this breaks, and then I'll have to head to the surface. Do it. Do it. Come on, you can make it. No! No, you're broke. You're broke on me. What's wrong with you? Why would you... Oh, I placed it back down. No! Stop! I keep placing it back down. Oh, my goodness. Right, let's see if I can remember how to get out of here. Um, you know what? I don't think it's going to be too bad. I just need to follow the torches, really. There are many torches, though. Um, okay, there's a there's a way out, out up there. Or is it around here? I'm not sure if this is my way out, but I'm going to use it anyway. Da, 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 da. Yeah, this is my way out. Of course it is. Ah! I keep falling in this hole that I made. Why didn't I patch it up? Right, I am going to be in ultra um, careful mode. Let me just put in a torch there. So nothing spawns down here. But we've been very, very lucky, guys. All we've had is a baby zombie attack us for our ankles. And we slayed him with a stone axe. We killed him with a stone axe. But I now need to be very careful because there might be some creepy crawlies up here. Are there going to be any creepy qualities? We are really close to home, so I can just, like, sprint and hope. Okay, we're, we're, we're really close to home. I did not know we were that close. <laughs> oh! Why? 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 No, 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 go away. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Oh, my goodness, these baby zombies. Baby zombies. Oh, jeez, it's you as well. No, 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 no. Quick, get in my house. Get in my house. Get in my house. Oh, jeez, no. This is why I am... No! Quick! Oh, he shot my bed. He shot my bed. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? He's right there, looking at me. Um, 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 I don't know what to do. Don't hit me. Don't hit me through there. Don't even do it. Don't even do it. Is he going to go around the edge? I'm just going to sleep. I'm going to sleep and see what happens. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Oh, I can't sleep because it's, oh, there's monsters nearby. Oh, I'm going to die. Guys, help me. No, stop it. Stop it. This is why I need windows. This is why I need windows. Right, I'm going to regen a little bit. I'm just going to stay in here. <laughs> I think that's the safest place to be. Is there anything else around, or can I sleep after this? We are so close to dying. I am super nervous. I don't know what's going to happen. Come on. Regen. Regen. And then I need to smack him. He's down there somewhere. I'm pretty sure. He's, like, down in the river. Where are you? Come at me. Come at me, please. Or can I just sleep? No, there's monsters nearby. There he is. There he is. Right, I'm going to smack you. Oh, no, 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 no. Come here. Come here. Come here. This is a standoff. This is a standoff. Where are you? Oh, you're there. Okay, right. Come come to come to me. Come to me. Come to me. Oh, jeez. Why do I do these things? I'm just gonna have to go out there and hit him, aren't I? Oh, this is this is terrifying. First, two baby zombies attack me. Now I've got this skeleton on my case. Who I can't actually sleep with sleep behind. I can't sleep. What is that? Ah! What is that? Oh my goodness! Look at these zombie villagers, they're so cool! They're- oh, they're really, really cool! They're the, they're the best zombies I've ever seen, they're amazing! Can I sleep now? Can I sleep now, please? No! This is gonna be- a, oh, there you are. Hello. Come here, come here, I'm just gonna kill you, I'm just gonna kill you, right, I've had enough of you, I've had enough of you. Your, your arrows do a lot of damage, sir. Right, collect those, get back in, and turn around, and sleep, 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 sleep. A cow is not a monster, yes! Am I gonna die? Don't die. Yes, I made it! I made it! So what I think we should do is quickly put all of this stuff in here. 32 iron, 33 coal, 3... Glorious mushrooms and an apple. Fantastic. <laughs> what else did we get? Uh, the bones could be quite handy for bone meal. But apart from that, guys, that was very, very, um, very scary indeed. But Alex, you did well, buddy. You did well. I'm very, very proud of you. <laughs> so, guys, thank you so much for watching episode two of Minecraft Pocket Edition. Remember, if you want this series to carry on daily, then please do show your support and leave a big fat thumbs up. That would be greatly appreciated. That was intense and scary, but we made it, and we also need to kind of finish this house. But I hope you enjoyed. If you did again, please leave a fat thumbs up. That'd be greatly appreciated. And also, if this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, then please do consider subscribing for daily Minecraft videos and to join Team TDM today. And that 
is going to be pretty much it from me. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Goodbye!